So we just got this security system in the mail today and I just wanted to unbox it and show you guys what exactly came with it. So as you can see here, it's the XRIM uh, HD video camera surveillance system. And we'll open it up and see what it actually looks like. So you can see here that it comes with the actual DVR system. There's a mouse that came with it. And there's four cameras in the other box. And then if I read the specifications right, it says that it comes with 60 feet of cord for the actual cables to run through that connect to the back of the camera. And then we have our power splitter right here. So that's gonna come in handy, definitely. And then with each camera comes a set of mounting screws. All right guys, so we're here the day before we're gonna install the cameras and I'm trying to find the best viewpoint of where I'm gonna mount this. So I was thinking about that corner over there, right up in there, but also if you look down the soffit, that looks like a good spot too, because like as you can see, these cameras can rotate and go however you want them to be. So you can mount them like this, but then you can rotate it to where it'll stay like that. So I'm just out here thinking about where I want to put it and also um, where I'm going to have to run these cables up into the rafters. So I just got to be mindful of that and thinking about where I want to go. field of view for the door and seeing where everybody can come through. I know most people kind of put it in the corner, but I think I'm going to put it in the middle. That way I can see almost like a 180 of whoever's coming up here. So um, I think that that might be a good spot. So right here above the door is where I'm going to put it. Not the greatest footage here, but this is the spare TV that we had. And you can see up in the left hand corner that we did a test dry run of one of the cameras and you can see that it's a free moving camera. Um, it's just going around wherever, wherever I'm aiming it at. So it's working pretty well. I just wanted to dry fit it and make sure that everything worked. Um, so when you do this, you're gonna have to make sure that you're connected to the internet and it's not a wireless system. So you're gonna have to have some sort of cable to connect there and then you're gonna need two power sources, one to power the actual DVR, and then another one that's gonna use for your four-way split. So you can see down here that it leads from one of the four-way splits, and then it goes to a power source. So you can see here that we have it installed into the soffit. We use three-inch screws to secure it, and it's not going anywhere. The little boggle that's wobbling is just the ball joint right here. And that swivels and you can tighten it wherever you want to go. We already have the XVim app uploaded to our iPad. So we're just going to use that and see where we want to adjust the camera angle at. And we can see that it's just covering all of this over here into a little patio section. Alright guys, so we're here on day two and unfortunately we're boxing in the Vixen cameras up and we're going to send them back. The main reason is just because the app didn't work and that's one of the main selling features that we wanted to get it for. The app would not play whenever we were not on our home network and you couldn't play back anything. It was basically useless. So if you're trying to use this for like a home network kind of thing where you can just use the hard drive and not the mobile app, this is perfect. The cameras were pretty clear, they were great at night even with um, no light outside. They were, they were really good. It was a good purchase just for that. But the main reason we wanted it was for the app. So just for that, based off of our perspective, we're not gonna keep it. We're gonna return it and we're gonna look into a new system.